boys and girls. Let me share with you the date. Today is Thursday and we are in a new moon. That's why I'm very excited. October 1st, 2020. Welcome to the English class. The best class because you and me are together working. In second grade, you are growing. Now the greetings. How about the weather? How is the weather like today? Perhaps could be cloudy. Or maybe could be windy. Perhaps could be rainy. But guess what? I looked through the window and today is sunny. Very good. It's very hot today. And we are going to ask you about your emotions. How do you feel today? Do you feel tired? Or maybe you feel sad? Perhaps today you feel a little bit angry. But I know most of you are happy, happy, right? Let's continue developing our language and communication development. Do you remember Harry of Joy's story? Yes? We are going to work with this later. Well, before that, let's go here. I'm going to share with you my bedroom. This is my bedroom. I have a bed. On my bed, I have a jojo. Under the bed, I have my jumping rope, my scooter, and my kite. Come here. In my toy box, I have a robot. This is my favorite toy. On my shelf, I have a plane. And also, I am going to share with you my favorite school object. It's the paintbrush. The paintbrush is on the shelf. On the shelf. My backpack will be on my bed. And my lunchbox next to my favorite toy in the toy box. Okay? In the toy box. Good job! Excellent! If this exercise will help us to develop something in our student book. Let's see. Everybody, take your student book. We are going to look for page number 18. Excellent. Here we have Joey. Do you remember the boy in the story? Here. Do you remember the boy in the story? Yes? Well, he missed lots of things about the school. Where can you see his pencil case? Here is his bedroom. Where can you see his pencil case? Here it is. The pencil case is under the bed. We are going to color the pencil bag or pencil case using blue, okay? Color the pencil bag blue. Very good. Next, let's look here in the toy box. In the toy box, we have the lunch box. Color it with yellow. Excellent, very good. The next question. On the shelf, we can see a dinosaur, a teddy bear, a car. Should Joey take his car to the school? Yes? 
To work at school? No, of course not. So, we are going to cross out the car. Okay? The toys are not allowed at school. At the bottom of the page, we have Joey looking for his book. Where can you see the book? Where is the book? The book is on the table. Okay, very good. So, we are going to circle. Excellent, very good. And where is the backpack? The backpack is on Joey's back. Right? So, we are going to color it using green. We are going to color it green. Excellent. Good job. Very good. Congratulations. You did it. Excellent. Now, to continue working about prepositions, we are going to look for our activity book. Open and look for page number six. Here we have the same exercise. This is Joey's house. He's looking for his school items. Where is the lunch box? The lunch box is under the bed. Where is the backpack? The backpack is on the sofa. Where is the pencil bag? The pencil bag is under the table. And the last. Where is the book? The book is in the toy box. Don't forget to trace the dotted lines in every school object, right? Then you can color them using your favorite colors. Okay, the next activity is including here in your activity book. We are going to make an exercise according to the page. Look for page number 47. Okay? Take out the sheet and we are going to use scissors and colors to work on it. Here, we are going to develop the exercise. We have Dino at a school. Yes? The next question is, does Dino need a sandwich to work at school? Yes or no? No, Dino, you don't need a sandwich to work at school. Does Dino need a crayon to work at school? Yes, he does. Excellent. Does Dino need a glue stick to work at school? Yes, of course. Does Dino need an orange juice to work at school? No, of course no. Does Dino need a pencil case or pencil bag to work at school? Yes, he does. Does Dino need a cookie to work at school? Of course not, Dino. Does Dino need a pencil? Yes, very good. Does Dino need a, an apple to work at school? No, of course not. 
What about the scissors? Yes, he needs to cut. And what about the lunchbox? Yes, he can bring it at the school because inside the lunchbox we have our lunch for our daily day. Okay, thank you very much. And what about the rest of the school items? that we don't need to bring at school. We are going to draw a big lunch box in a sheet of paper. And you will create your own lunch box. We put inside the apple, the sandwich, the cookie, and the juice to make your own lunchbox, okay? You take a picture and send it to Miss Matus in classroom, okay? Well, I think that's all for today. Well, I'm going to, to show you again the page for you to recognize much better the school items, right? Color, cut, and glue. Where are you going to glue? Where are you going to paste them? Here, in your language notebook. In your language notebook. Open and look for this activity. Here we have the activity, a school supplies review. Here you are going to paste all the school items for Dino. Okay? Go ahead. Thank you very much for coming to my class. See you tomorrow.